Ivanka Trump's time in the White House is coming to an end. With President Donald Trump's four-year term in office set to expire in January 2021, so too will Ivanka's job as senior advisor to her father. And when that day comes, what's her next career move? Will she stay in Washington, D.C. or return to New York? Before we explore the possibilities, let's review Ivanka's work history and how she entered the global spotlight with the help of her father's presidency. She got her first taste of widespread fame when she appeared on her dad's now-defunct show, The Celebrity Apprentice. Ivanka became a regular on the reality show in 2006, where she grew comfortable working side-by-side -side with her father in the spotlight. In a 2014 interview with WWLP22 News in Massachusetts, Ivanka spoke about the experience of working with her father. It's a lot of fun. I would say for me, it's a less intense version of real life because I'm on the same side of the table as opposed to the other side of the desk. It's safe to say she took this experience with her to the White House, which is fitting considering some of Trump's opponents have accused him of running America like a reality TV show. With all of this exposure, Ivanka has reportedly received attractive offers for her life and work post-White House. In a move that's like father, like daughter, Ivanka Trump reportedly has received several offers to appear on reality TV. According to OK Magazine, before the votes were even counted on election day, Ivanka was getting courted by a number of different productions. As one TV executive told the outlet, you have to remember that reality TV made this family superstars. It was appearing on The Celebrity Apprentice next to their father, Donald Trump, that made Ivanka, Donald Jr., and Eric into primetime stars. For the kids to return to reality TV shouldn't be a surprise, and neither should be the fact that Ivanka is the family member that is getting the most offers, including interest from Dancing with the Stars. The outlet pointed out that since Ivanka is now one of the most famous daughters in the world, she has the power regarding her future. According to an OK Magazine source, she knows that what she does right now will determine her future for years to come. She isn't opposed to going back to reality shows. After all, her dad became the president after his reality show. As Politico pointed out, it's unlikely Ivanka will return to heading fashion lines and shoe companies. Her time in the White House gave her exposure that was much more intense than she had previously experienced, so it's more probable she'll opt for a more visible opportunity. Now that the election is over, one thing seems entirely plausible. Ivanka Trump might go for another book deal. It's something she's done before, with 2009's The Trump Card and 2017's Women Who Work, leading The Guardian and other outlets to speculate that there's a lucrative book deal in her future. The appeal of a book deal isn't just financial. As Vanity Fair notes, since Donald Trump lost the 2020 presidential election, Ivanka has desperately been trying to rehabilitate her image. The outlet noted that Ivanka has been active and remarkably busy on Twitter, trying to highlight positive things from her father's four years in office. A new book could do so much more than a tweet for Ivanka as she tries to navigate a post-White House world. As Refinery29 notes, she can use the book to put some distance between herself and the unsavory memories of her father's administration. As the outlet explained, she could use a book to help rebrand herself as a more moderate voice, in line with the lifestyle expert image she tried to cultivate before her father entered politics. But this attention to rebranding doesn't necessarily mean Ivanka's planning on leaving politics for good. In fact, many sources predict we'll see her in a political capacity in the foreseeable future. Regardless of where Ivanka Trump decides to call home after her father's time in the White House comes to an end, it seems likely she'll remain in politics to some degree. Speaking to the Washington Post, the former creative director of Ivanka's now shuttered namesake company, Marissa Kratzberger, said that Ivanka is identical to Donald Trump and that they're equally ambitious. She explained what she thinks Ivanka's true long-term goals are, saying, I think she'd want to be the first female president. I don't think she's actually ever had any interest in fashion, but everything was an angle to gain more power in whatever possible way. Another source noted that Ivanka isn't the only Trump kid who's got eyes on a political future. Donald Trump Jr. has also developed a taste for politics, and the two might end up in something of a power struggle in the years to come. Donald Trump himself seems to be pushing Ivanka toward the presidency. At a rally in New Hampshire in August 2020, he brought up the idea of the first woman president to the crowd, adding his own commentary on who he and his supporters might like to see take the role. They're all saying we want Ivanka. 
Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about the latest hot topics are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.